Welcome everyone to a five minute workout. Today we are gonna be doing some standing work facing the side on the reformer. So I have, I'm starting with one light, one blue spring. You can start with a heavy, you can increase the resistance as you get stronger, but I'm gonna combine some upper and lower body work on this. So I'm gonna use a little bit of a lighter spring for myself today. I'm gonna start with my feet wide and my knees bent and I'm hinged just slightly forward. I wanna be far enough away from the strap so that I have to rotate to line my sternum up with the strap and then I'm gonna rotate and come back. Now for this first part, you're gonna exhale as you rotate, inhale as you return and for this first part, you're gonna keep your weight centered on your feet and make the movement come from the spine rotation rather than the pelvis rotation or swinging your arms. In order to do that, we try to keep the weight centered on our feet the whole time through the whole range of motion. And we also keep the hands right in line with the sternum the whole time. All I'm gonna do is hinge further forward here. So I'm coming down across and back, similar to a kind of a golf swing, a pseudo golf swing, not a real one. I'm not a golfer. My spine is long and I'm rotating it. Exhale, inhale to return. Two more, one more here. Woo, I can feel those obliques, man. I'm gonna come up tall. Then I'm gonna step my feet together toward the pulley end. Now I'm gonna hold the spine straight and I'm gonna start with straight legs. I'm gonna push away into kind of a fencer lunge and then come back. So the leg I'm pushing off of stays straight and come back, push and come back. Two more, feel the outside of the glute, one more and hold it here. Now I'm just gonna shift from side to side. I'm really using this back leg here to push and then return and I'm staying Toes are tucked under the reformer here, I can't see them, and hands are staying right in line with that shoulder rest. Two more, push, one more, push, and come back. All right, we gotta balance this out, so let's go to the other side. And we start with our spine twist. So, remember, stand far enough away so that you have to rotate to the start position. Knees are bent, weight is centered, I rotate and come back. Toes are under the reformer. Exhale to turn. Inhale to come back. The further you move your hands away from your sternum, the harder it's gonna be. Now, let's take that same movement, hinged over. Rotate and back. Two and back. Try to keep the weight centered on your feet, three. Four, so you're not shifting from side to side. Your upper body's what's rotating. And five. Come on up, step together toward the pulley. Hands right in line with the sternum. Push into that fencer lunge and come back. Two, push out. Control the return. Three. Four, and on five we hold it there. And we bend back and forth. Side to side lunge, one. And exhale, push, two. Hands right in line with the sternum, three. Hands over the shoulder rest, four. Right in line with it, one more, five. Come back and rise up. And guys, that does it for our quick side body workout today. I hope that you enjoyed it and I look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye, buddy.